What is happening guys, Staff Sergeant Massey here, also known as Art Chisel on social media, and welcome to another episode of US Army Basic Combat Training Mini-Series, Your Future Starts Here. For today's episode, we're going to be talking about the US Army uniforms. It doesn't matter if it's the OCPs, the dress blues, but for me, what really matters the most is the beret. This is that moment where it completes your look as a soldier. But if you're a trainee halfway about to graduate, you can see right there, the finish line is right there. Without further ado, we're gonna share you a few more stories as usual from trainees and a drill sergeant on what it means to them to wear the US Army uniform. So today we have them going through deferred issue, basically where they're gonna receive their ASUs um, and anything associated with that, so berets, shirts, pants. Once they get their dress uniforms, they start to see everything that they're receiving at that point, and they're just looking, they're looking forward more to graduation because that's the uniform that they're gonna wear whenever they walk across that field. So they still have to learn how to shape and wear the beret. We actually take them up and give them a class. We watch them very carefully because they actually shave their berets and so if we just let them go loose they're gonna put holes in them and, and cut the wrong parts and all that stuff so we still shape their berets with them and uh, we, we make sure that they're fitting properly and looking good. The best uh, advice I could give for somebody that's looking to join the Army, you're not gonna know exactly what you're getting into but just go in with an open mind Make sure that don't don't keep quitting on the back burner like that's an option because in your mind it shouldn't be an option. Whenever you join the army, you're going to be basically doing the best thing you could ever do to jumpstart your life. I mean, whenever you're whenever you're looking at you know everyone that's your age right now, and then you're going to see a noticeable difference once you graduate of everything that you've accomplished, things that you thought you would never do. You're putting yourself ahead of your own age group. Um, and I think that you know the country needs something like that right now because you know a lot of people don't understand what it means to serve. So today we got fitted for our skirts, we got fitted for our shirts, our berets, um, our pants. My pants were a little bit long; they had to fix it. Um, we got a size for our right size shoes. Um, I have 7.5, and uh, we got our big coats. Uh, and we got size for our graduation uniform. It made me feel very like to keep on going, to not give up, because you're one step ahead. And it made me feel like you're this close to graduating, so just keep up. I joined because my family right now, they're struggling financially, and I found that the Army could help me with my college, especially since I wanted to do criminal justice. Drill sergeants, my battle buddies, uh, my family a lot. My family back home will see me writing letters telling me to keep on going, and they're waiting for me back home. That one motivates me a lot. It feels amazing because I remember getting that letter from my mom and I just saw her handwriting and felt like she was writing, she was speaking to me. It is great to receive letters every time. Hola, soy Private Nicole Paiva Rodriguez y quiero mandar saludos a mi mamá que me está viendo y te extraño y cuídense todos. Gracias. So, my favorite MRE is this one right here. It's the cheese tortellini and um, it comes with trail mix, vanilla pudding, um, crackers and peanut butter chocolate and the cheese toilet, which is not that good, but I like the desserts. 